Scott Trade's business model empowers individual investors with financial management autonomy, as you were just describing. What would you consider to be the primary reasons people are drawn to this kind of investment structure or investing mechanism? I think the main driver that, that uh, propelled self-directed investing at the beginning was economics, mm -hmm. for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, back then, you could spend over $900 in commission to buy 1,000 shares of IBM. And obviously, wow. if you think buying and selling could be close to $2,000 commission for just 1,000 shares, people didn't tend to trade too much back and forth because the commissions would take all your profit away. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the discount brokerage industry lowered those costs dramatically to 25 to $50 maybe at the time. So that was the main impetus. But as it's matured uh, into a mostly an online self-directed business, uh, it's probably the information flow that has that has propelled it for the last 10 or 15 years. The customers are smarter, they're better educated, and they have so much more to, uh, to see on the web than they ever did uh, when they were going to the library and looking through a, a standard poor book. So Absolutely. plenty of information. People with a lot of college degrees are the ability to analyze things and make up their own mind. Mm -hmm. And of course, the cost is still important, but maybe not quite like it was at the beginning. It's interesting, today we would call that kind of change in a market a disruption, which is one of those words that has both a negative and a positive connotation, but we know in our modern vocabulary and use of that word that it means a fundamental move the needle shift, which is exactly what you did. So how do you gauge the appetite for the disruptive investment model that you created? How do you um, measure whether it's working or not working? Well, I think we've always uh, measured it just by how we compare it to our competition. It's really hard to, especially at the beginning, to know what was out there because mm -hmm. it mushroomed into a much larger industry and a much more used method of investing than anybody would have ever thought, probably. So mm -hmm. we just continue to try to improve our services, our offerings, our customer service, make sure the cost doesn't go up. And uh, with some good marketing, we tend to just continue to grow the firm.